my bath on. I'm sorry, guys. We Don't got, mind. We, we gotta we gotta find a different place. We gotta like find like a little another location or something. We get, maybe we should like go outside for lunch and now. Think that's a good idea? Yeah. Like uh, but of course uh. Fortune. I think. So. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, I remember uh, we did that once and uh, there sorry was no about trouble. That. Okay. There was uh, really no trouble with that. We didn't. Uh, nobody walked over to us. No nothing. Yeah. Well, that's true. Yeah. And well, except because we're in winter right now, so we don't want to be outside and all that stuff. So we're just gonna have to wait till like springtime. You know, it, it, you know, it's, it's no one's fault. It's just people coming in at, at a bad time, really. You know. So anyway, mm -hmm. back I to what I was saying. That. Um, Venom, of course, is you know we saw Venom for the first time. I. He wasn't all bad, I just thought, because Venom was more of a bulky type, you know. He was huge. And, 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 and Topher Grace's role, he was a little scrawny. I wish they just computer generated to make him look more bigger, rather than just make him look like, you know, he stole Spider-Man's suit. That's basically it. Look like he stole his suit. I'm just saying, that's my opinion. Um, mm -hmm. At this this sense they are gonna do a Venom spin-off the planning on to. First of all, this is gonna be a spin-off of Spider-Man, they have to put Eddie Brock in Spider-Man. Now what I'm saying is you don't have to turn to Venom right away, you know, just made him into a character and then maybe he has a sin of and at the end he runs. I mean, because there's too much like if they put a lot of those lot of villains, it's gonna be too much and stuff. So yeah, and first of all, um, Eddie Brock is supposed to be a bodybuilder. He's not a. I think even the ultimate he was a photographer. In the original, he was a bodybuilder. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, they should have Carnage. And I think Cle the only person they want Cleus Pasley is Jim Carrey. Oh yes. Yeah, that that sounds good. That sounds uh, pretty good since uh, Jim Carrey has a has the personality of it, like, uh, you know, in Riddler, uh, when he was Riddler in, uh, uh, Batman Forever. Yeah, Batman Forever. He was, uh, his personality in, as, uh, the Riddler was, like, pretty crazy. So, yeah. So, uh, I think with, uh, Cletus Cassie, he'd have to be acting, uh, a little bit more crazy. So, bingo. Well, yeah. Kind of like in a Heath Ledger way when he did Joker, something like that. I mean, you don't have to copy what Heath Ledger did, but you know, you could be a little bit humor, but not too, you know, what happened to Spider-Man Three. Well, that's true. That's true. Something like psychotically, really. Something like that. Because after all, Cleo is a serial killer. Mm -hmm. Um. And of course they want, they're going to have, except they're going to have Venom as an anti-hero and, uh, and, um, Carnage as the villain. Anti-hero as in someone who, anti-hero you already know is, is someone who's not really a hero, but it's not the bad guy. They're like, there's like a, you know, they're not, you know, they're trouble, but, you know, it's <coughs> not their fault or something like that. That yeah. sort of thing. Mm -hmm. I guess you could say they're, uh... Like, uh, as I've, uh, thought of, thought of people like that, like, uh, white demons, they do, uh, they're still, they're still bad, but, uh, in, in some ways they're also good. Mm-hmm. Like, uh, or they do, uh, bad things for a good, good purpose. Well, that's also true, Marshall. Yeah. And I think this is good, because maybe Cletus, Cla Cletus Cassidy was in the Spider-Man reboot or the sequel. He could yeah. be sort of like in the Daily Bugle uh, serial killer on the loose. And you could, there's like a picture of uh, Cletus Cassidy's picture on the front cover. How's that sound? Well, I think that sounds good. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, or, like, you could say... What's happened uh, with Venom, uh, or like, uh, as Cleus, as uh, this, is this really uh, uh, Venom or someone else? Mm-hmm. Something like that. 
Um, yeah. And, um, you know, I think Venom, I mean, it, 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 yeah, so I'm guessing they should have Eddie Brock in the reboot sequel. And, you know, that sort of thing. And then Chris Cassie could be like sort of serial killer. <coughs> and then something happens and then they leave or something. And that's what it's been off for. So, you know, really don't we don't know much about it yet, so we'll, I'll keep you posted to see if there's anything new come on. Because I know they're doing the screen, they're writing the script right now, and I think there's some rewrites and some editing and stuff, so we're going to see what happens. So anyway, that's all we have to say for now. Yes. Uh, this is Elsie Hernandez. Marshall Pyers. And my name is Fortune P. Fields. This is Let's Talk. Thank you. And comment. And comment, and let me know what you guys want in the movie. Peace.